Assalamu alaikum guys, welcome back to Civil Engineers YouTube channel with the new lecture. Guys, today I am discussing in this video the very important topic related with quantity survey. How much steel and cement is required for 1000 square feet RCC house? Especially non civil engineering people, before starting building construction, they are confused that what should be the cost of steel and cement for 1000 square feet covered area of course guys it's very important for you people to know about this especially if you are working on construction site or if you are civil engineering students if you are studying so it's important for you to know about this topic so let's start guys if this video is helpful for you so don't forget to like this video and subscribe the channel with press bell icon if you are new let's start guys the topic is how much steel and cement is required for 1000 square feet rcc house but the method is here by thumb rule okay very important guys you can see this is a covered area which is 1000 square feet for a residential house not for commercial building okay this is for residential building 1000 square feet covered area and we required how much steel and cement is required so let's start guys first of all i will tell you that this quantity of steel which I am telling you in this video, this is just for ground floor. This is just for ground floor. So after watching the video, many students they are asking from me that sir, is this quantity or is this thumb rule is using for one story or for two story or for multi story? No guys, this is just for ground floor. And also, remember, a residential building a residential building height not more than 3 meter okay so this thumb rule is using for a residential building not for commercial building ha height not more than three meter so if the height is more than three meters so it's going to first story and second story and third story so you can't use this formula this is just for ground floor and included with steel quantity and cement quantity included with foundation beam column slab it's steel okay also so this is for steel and for cement same for foundation beam column slab and also for plastering cement quantity okay so remember guys this is not a detailed estimate so if you want to find if you want to calculate the quantity of steel that how much steel and cement is required for 1000 square feet so for that you will do detail estimation for foundation for beam column slab especially for cement and also for steel if and slab if you want to find the quantity of the steel so there you required main bars and distribution bars and also its dia its spacing this is called detail estimate and for beam we will find the quantity of steel and stirrups quantity of steel uh, longitudinal bars also in column also in beam etc and foundation so that is called detail estimation okay but here in this video this is by thumb rule for residential building height not more than three meter so guys steel the first one is steel okay steel 4 kgs okay per square feet so for one square feet we required 4 kg just 4 kg of steel for a residential if the height is not more than 3 meter and from foundation to the top slab we required for one square feet 4 kg of steel so with this formula we required for 1000 square feet okay so for 1000 square feet or for 
1000 square feet covered area we required 4000 kg steels kgs we required steel 4000 kgs steel required to cover this house rcc house right now guys come to say cement okay guys by thumb rule okay we required cement is required 0.4 bags 0.4 bag per square feet we required 0.4 bag per square foot so guys for 1000 square feet we required 0.4 multiply 1000 so guys we required 400 cement bags 400 bags required for 1000 square feet covered area of rcc house very important for you so guys here for 400 bags numbers of bags we can cover plastering column concrete slab concrete beam foundation concrete from start to end just for ground floor not for multi-story building okay so you can cover this house by 400 numbers of bag okay so the bag weight should be 50 kg okay so one bag weight should be 50 kg but here guys we have other point especially and steel okay so if the dia of steel is up to 20 mm not more than 20 mm if the dia is more than 20 mm especially in beam column or in foundation in slab especially for distribution or for main bars so you will face a problem because you cannot complete this house rcc house 1000 square feet house by 4000 kgs because if the dia is more than 12 mm up to 12 mm dia of steel you can cover this house construction okay so this is not a detailed estimate so approximately you required this formula to find quantity of steel and also cement so if you have 3000 square feet if you have 4000 square feet so you required this formula to use and find the quantity of steel and cement so guys this video is especially for those people which are not a civil engineer just they are confused what should be the cost of steel and what should be the cost of cement for house construction this is especially for you people and if you are working on construction site especially for civil engineers so you can say approximately by this formula so guys this is uh, the very important topic which i've discussed the front of you if this video is helpful for you so don't forget to like this video and subscribe the channel with press bell icon and yes if you have any question about this video so you can comment i will try to reply your answer thanks for watching see you in next video Goodbye.